In this video we look at the ladder stitch. Stay with me and I'll show you how. The ladder stitch is used as a foundation for other stitches. This can be done either one or two bead size. I will show you both. I'm using size 8 seed beads, but if you find this fiddly, you could try Delica beads, as they naturally want to sit straight due to their cylindrical shape. We begin by threading our needle with about an arm's length of thread. We then pick up two beads and we slide them down to the end, leaving about a six inch tail. We pass our needle back through the bead nearest the tail end, passing through the same side the tail is exiting from. Our thread making a little loop, joining the two beads together. We pass back down through the next bead, pinching the beads with thumb and forefinger to keep the work tight. We pass our needle through both these beads again to help keep them anchored in place. We pick up a new bead and we pass back through the old bead in the opposite direction the thread is coming out of. Here the thread is coming out of the bottom so we pass through the top of the bead. We then pass back up through the bead we've just added. We pick up another bead. Our thread is coming out of the top of the last bead so we sew through the bottom joining the beads together. We then sew back down through the bead we've just added. We pick up another bead. Our thread is coming out of the bottom so we sew down through the top, then back up through the new bead. We pick up another bead. Our thread is coming out of the top, so we sew up through the bottom, and back down through the new bead. And that's how you do the ladder stitch. Carry on in that way until you reach your desired length. You can also do this stitch with two rows of beads. For this variation we pick up four beads and we slide those down to the end of the thread leaving about a six inch tail. We then sew back up the first two beads coming in the same end as the tail is coming out of. We then sew back down through the next two beads. We pick up two more beads. Our thread is coming out the bottom of these two beads. So we sew back down through the top. Then back up through the two beads we've just added. Pick up two more beads. Our thread is coming out the top of these two beads. So we sew up through the bottom. And back down through the two beads we've just added. Pick up two beads. Our thread is coming out of the bottom of these last two beads, so we sew back down through the top and back up through the two beads we've just added. Pick up two beads. Our thread is coming out of the top of these two, so we sew back up through the bottom and then we sew back down through the two beads we've just added. Continue until you've reached your desired lengths. And that's how to do the ladder stitch.